Hey guys, it's Ali. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. This week's video is just going to be my university decision reactions. I actually started filming this back in November and I've compiled it all the way up to now. Um, I see so many people in the States posting videos like these, but I haven't seen a single one about like Canadian universities. So I thought I would just put this out there and show, share it with you guys. If you guys have any questions, feel free to comment them down below or shoot me a DM on Instagram and I'll try to get back to you as soon as possible. So without further ado, let's just get on into it. This is really uncomfortable. <laughs> also, I thought I'd just pop in to explain a bit how the Canadian university application process works. It's really different than the States because there you just sort of apply to one school and be like, oh, I sort of want to study this. But here in Canada, you apply to your program directly out of high school. So because of this, each school has like a limit on how many programs you can apply to. And I really didn't know what I wanted to study. So I applied to business, health science, um, computer science computer engineering, so you'll see a variety of things in this video. Okay, so the first decision I received was back in November. I actually received it like a week or so after I applied, and these are from my more like safety schools here in Ottawa. Unless I got into Shopify's dev degree, but I did not get into that, so... I just hopped out of the shower and one of my friends texted me saying that the master life side decisions are out so I'm gonna go and check that now. I'm scared. <laughs> I got accepted! Yay! <laughs> this is one of my safety programs but it's great to know that I got accepted to a university outside of Ottawa so I'm so excited. Yay! So for the longest time, UFT Computer Science was one of my top choices. And when the decisions came out in March, February, March, when, well, the second round of decisions came out, I was actually in the middle of like a French group evaluation that, with our class. And someone texted me and I was like, can't wait. So I checked it during the evaluation. It's okay, like my part was already over, but like, yeah, so I checked it like underneath the table. That's why this clip is going to be really short. It's literally two seconds, but let's roll it. Okay, so I just got an email from Miguel saying that admission decisions came out, and of course it's right after I finish my shower, again, like why does this keep happening? Unfortunate timing, but I'm about to go check now, I'm so scared. Like my grades passed the cutoff average that they said, like, that was required from like last year, but like, our grades like super smart, so will I even get it? Oh my god, I'm so nervous. A decision to your application has been made. Okay, so I applied for two programs, one for computer science and one computer science and biology double major. So I'm gonna check my computer science one first because I think I have more of a chance of getting into that one. Got in! Woo! Okay, okay, let's feel the letter. Wait, this is so exciting. It says it is my great pleasure to offer you admission to McGill University. Congratulations on your accomplishment. This letter is your official and only proof of admission to the program named below. Yes. Woo! Okay, well, that's great. Okay, I'm going to check my other program now, which is Computer Science and Biology. How do I go back? Okay. Got into this one too! Yes! We're thriving! Okay, nice. So, got into both my McGill programs, which is really exciting. Um, oh, I forgot to mention, today is May May 6th, so the rest of my decisions will be coming out soon. And, yeah. I'm excited! Okay, that's it. Bye, guys!
Okay, so it's like a couple hours later. It's 11.20 now, and I just opened my mail and saw that Mac Admit, sent, like McMaster Admissions, sent me an email, and I tried to close the email as soon as possible, like the application, but I already saw the title of the email, and it was, congratulations on your offer. Um, I actually applied to three programs at McMaster, and I already got into one of them. I know one of them doesn't come out yet, so that leaves me with one more that, well, like, now I know I got in, but like... <laughs> you didn't really get to see my reaction now, so I'm just like, oh, I close the app. But I'm gonna go read the actual like letter now and see what it says. Congratulations on your academic achievement. We are pleased to offer you admission to Integrated Biomedical Engineering and Health Science Co-op at McMaster University. <laughs> Woo! Okay, this has been such a good night. I went into three programs in the span of like two hours. But like, I'm not sure if I want to go here. But it's a good option to keep open. Okay. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> See you guys later. Wait, I waved last time. Bye. I do that all the time. You know what? Let's just tra transition. Okay, I know I wasn't really excited about this acceptance, but basically, if you're not from Canada, you might not know that McMaster I Biomed is one of the newer programs. It was just integrated, I think, in 2017, so they don't actually have any graduates from it yet. I did not know how competitive it was until I researched the program after I already received my decision, and apparently, like, the admission average in 2017 was, like, 95% or something crazy, so that's why my reaction was a little anticlimactic because I didn't really know how competitive it was to get in so yeah wait I got in wait what the heck I got into the master health science what Okay, so for my Waterloo decision, I was actually on FaceTime with two of my best friends, and then my friend's brother got accepted, and this is at like 11 o'clock at night, so I was like, oh, you know what, I'm just gonna go ahead and check mine. I didn't think that like my... I didn't think that my status would be updated because I just checked at like 7 o'clock and it had only been like a couple of hours. But then I checked again and I got in and then I wasn't really filming at the time because I was on FaceTime. So I took a screen recording on the FaceTime because I thought there would be audio. But there is no audio, but you know what? Enjoy anyways. <laughs> Hey guys, I'm taking a break from studying now and I'm gonna go check my Waterloo again. The thing with Canadian decisions is that they don't have a specific day where they send them out, like it's rolling admissions, so you never know when your portal can be updated. So I think I filmed this like 10 times already. Wait, I'm a bit confused. Maybe. Okay, well, it says I've been given a conditional admission by the program. It says Geomatics Honors Co-op Program. I definitely did not apply for that. So maybe they're giving me, like, an alternate offer. I'm going to wait for a while until, like, the letter pops up. And, yeah, I'm pretty sure I got rejected, well, deferred from this program. So that ruins my streak. But, yeah, honestly, I'm not that surprised. Yeah. Okay, yeah, I definitely did not apply to this Geomatics Honors Program. I got into CE last week, so I'm pretty sure I got... To, oh, that was... I totally missed. So I'm pretty sure this is a deferral. Wait! U of T Einstein off, gave, gave me an offer. Are you sure? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. Come look. <laughs> But here it just says offer. Oh, <laughs> well, then we tell the world. <laughs> Wait, how did that happen? 
Dear Ali, your record of achievement has distinguished you in a pool of exceptional applicants and it is our privilege to offer you admission to the Engineering Science Program in the University of Toronto's Faculty of Applied Science... Blah, 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 so long, so long. We are pleased to inform you that in recognition of your outstanding achievement in secondary school and your extracurricular involvement, you have been awarded the Dean's Merit Award valued at $2,000. Wait, I'm good. Okay, nice. I feel like that was a bad angle, but... Okay, also, I just received an email from Queens. I'm pretty sure I got rejected because the acceptances come out in rolling admission and the latest round has already come out like two days ago. Also, it says, thanks for applying, so like you already know it's gonna be... I regret to inform you. Okay, it says, Dear Ali, thank you for applying. I'm writing to update blah, blah, blah. That program is extremely competitive and we have many more qualified applicants than we can accommodate. After careful consideration of your application and supporting documents, I regret to inform you that we are not able to make you an offer admission and that blah, 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 blah. Okay, well, that's okay. Um, got into a bunch of other programs that I'm super excited about. So, you know, this is fine. So Queen's Commerce is one of the best business programs here in Canada, along with University of British Columbia Sauter School of Business. I just reacted to their decision like a few hours ago, but by then I sort of already knew that I didn't want to do business. That's why I wasn't like that sad. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this week's video. If you enjoyed, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below and I'll see you all next week. Bye!